Alistair and his team use seven tons of flour each week to create everything from sourdough to spelt and baguettes to chewy brown. We have our ingredients here, basically. Water, flour, salt, yeast. So this is your basic bread, right? Yeah. So if I go along to the supermarket and I get a, a loaf off the shelf and it's a low-cal diet loaf, what are they taking out or what are they adding to this to make it low-calorie? I don't know, because if you take the flour out of there, you're going to get a soup. You haven't heard of any clever ingredient that you can add to... to I haven't, it. but, you know, I, I, I mean, maybe, maybe there is something. Um, you haven't had much You can tell me so. about it. No, we haven't had a lot of call for it. You know. Matt still hasn't been able to find out how they cut the calories from diet bread. No one seems to know. No idea. It's the stuff they put into it, isn't it? Bacteria, fungus. They must do something to the flour. So he's decided to visit dietitian Melissa Little to get some answers. Right. So I'd imagine in diet bread there's, there's something clever going on. There's a, there's a raising agent, there's something to lighten it, there's a different type of flour, there's... I don't know what. They're doing something, aren't they? Because there's, there's, what, 51 calories in that? Yeah. Which doesn't sound that much. Here. This one's 50. And what, what would you and find in the regular And the normal ones is about 100, 100 calories per slice. OK. So pretty so, much double. So what are they doing? How do you take the calories out of bread? Here we have a slice of your low calorie. OK. And then this is a regular. Right, OK. Which fails? OK. Which feels a lot heavier. Yeah, and if you hold them up... It's smaller. It's smaller. You're kidding me. <laughs> is that true? <laughs> Diet bread is smaller. It's smaller. It's about portion control. With Weight Watchers, this is done by variation in slice and loaf size that are then given their own pro points value, allowing customers to make informed choices. Hovis Nimble use more protein and an open top bake to create slices that are less dense and smaller in size. They told us that using these ingredients and processes are more costly. Weight Watchers said that the price of their bread is set by the retailer, not the manufacturer. And often they're charging you more for the diet stuff. So if you figure out the price per gram, you're actually paying more. It opens up a whole new world of diet goods for me. <laughs> diet cheesecake. Eat a little Just bit. Just eat half. <laughs> <laughs>